Good day, good day! How the fuck are ya? This is your friend Dan O, and this is Roverland, the YouTube channel that's anything and everything Land Rover. Have I got a video for you today? All right, all right, all right. Hey, welcome to another video. This is your friend Dano. Hey, give me a thumbs up. We got uh, kind of a different video today. Not per se Land Rover related, but uh, this is a channel that's anything and everything Land Rover, and we have Land Rovers. But I want to talk to you about these here cases that are in the background. Um, so I here shortly, hopefully, I'm going to uh, kind of redo the background here. I've, this is uh, the background here is a box that I've got uh, portioned up there so I can uh, have a backdrop uh, Land Rover related theme. But I think I want to, well, I'm, I'm going to keep that, but I have to uh, change uh, how it's made. Oh, I got to get a three by folder uh, for displays and uh, print off some of this. Uh, um, printing on this box get a nice section that i can print duplicate but i'm gonna have to do that at a print shop but anyway that's uh kind of what i'm doing and i was thinking about uh displaying some vehicles too and the reason why i came across this thought or whatnot is uh this last uh weekend i was uh shopping and um i came across these little buggers here, and um, they're from the Dollar Tree. That's a, a chain of, um, I don't know, uh, low budget things. Most of the things, obviously Dollar Tree, uh, everything in the store is a dollar or less, like two for a dollar, uh, such and so forth, but it was uh, a dollar. Now, just recently the company Dollar Tree did change and up their prices, so now usually it's a dollar and a quarter uh, on on everything now. But uh, I think they're doing a fair job at uh, keeping everything uh, economical. So we're gonna look at this uh, particular thing for uh, later. But first, I want to show you kind of what what uh, most of us collectors uh, put our die casts or loose die casts in if they don't hang them on the wall in a carny case which uh big and expensive but uh spares and things like that are put in these uh thread boxes now i can get mine uh well you can get them on ebay or, or amazon uh you know obviously but i get mine from joanne fabrics and um what it is it's a thread box and if you don't know what these are uh, just yeah, yeah, welcome newbies. But anyway, it has a big door on it. These are uh, double sided, and you can see it has an indent here. So you can, you're supposed to, the original uh, design is that you could pick out your thread. There would be, um, I don't know, a thimble, a thread? No, not a thimble, a card with uh, knitting thread, so you, they're meant so you can grab them to the side and pull them out. But they're very nice for storing, and I have, oh, I don't know, a whole shelf, <laughs> probably over 10 of these, 12 of these, and I just recently bought some more uh, because I only buy them when they're on sale. Now, normally these are like, uh, 15 to 17 dollars something like that and I would buy them when they were 40 to 50 percent off Joanne would have um, a uh, sale on them every once in a while well this last weekend I was at uh, Joanne Fabrics and uh, oh were they 40 or 50 percent off I I think they were 50 percent off but and maybe backstory here these have been out of stock since Corona uh, so a year and a half, a year, these have been out of stock. You just couldn't buy them. So when they did come back in stock, yeah, the price went up, which, you know, the price of everything's going up little bit by little bit. Not bad. It was like uh, 19 bucks and some change. So 15, 50% uh, off, they were under $10. Uh, so, you know, that's 
pretty decent price then, you know. These these hold, um, what is it? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, sixteen, and uh, twenty-four per side. So that's almost that's forty-eight cars, almost fifty cars that you could store in these. But they are double-sided and they're kind of bulky and they're big, you know, and expensive. So I I do like I say I do buy them one because my loose collection is growing. Two, um, I, I have older ones that I've gotten throughout the years or whatever and broke or they're uh, old and discolored and just need to be updated. So I'll use them for shows or something like that. So anyway, so I got one of those, but then I also went to the Dollar Tree, as I said, and I found these little things and they're in the toy aisle, Turbo Wheels Collector Showcase. And if you're interested, I know if you have a Dollar Tree next to you, near you, you can take this UPC code, you can go on dollartree.com or whatever, uh, the Dollar Tree website, and you can put in this code, the UPC, and you can order a case at a time. And I want to say there's probably, what is it? I don't know, 12, less than 20 per case but uh let's just take a look at them now this kind of these are i i these are just standing up here kind of loosely kind of precariously kind of dangerously so i don't want to mess around with them too much but as you see they interlock with each other and i don't know okay yeah as you slide them back here and they will unlock themselves so that's pretty cool so you can stack them and then uh the other thing too is you can see that they have holes in the back here so you can mount that to a wall now if you're gonna mount it to the wall um, <laughs> uh, WFOR uh, the Canadian the crazy Canadian that collects Hot Wheels if you don't know he's got a YouTube, YouTube channel WFOR um, and you can figure out what that means but he has bought these, like, plain, he's bought Plano cases, which are uh, bigger or whatever, and you can take the door off, and you can hang them, because they have, but he was playing loud music, now he p mounted his first flush, and he's playing loud, 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 mouthy loud music upstairs, and it vibrated, and some of his cars came off, so he went back, and he took all the cars off, and put some something behind him, to kind of put a tilt to them instead of flat they had a tilt so they wouldn't fall out and if they vibrated they would vibrate back now the nice thing too is these these uh, have compartments that come out as well you can see it's a kind of a I don't know is that tongue and groove but it's a little groove um, thing that comes and like I said it does come with a door which can snap right off these go right in there like that and so you can, yeah, and you can just store them like this too. You can mount it to the wall and not have anything fall out and kind of be dust free. It won't be dust proof, but dust free. So you could do it like that because it, it, you can still see your car is pretty good. Where, where this one from uh, Joanne Fabrics is a little bit more cloudier, maybe just a little bit, where this is a little bit more clear. I don't know how this stuff would handle under UV lighting if it would cloud up eventually. But anyway, so I took my doors off because I want to um, kind of put a wall and put up some things that people could look at and see. Now I'm going to, like I say, I want to do this backdrop here, the Land Rover Genuine Parts thing. I want to put that in a tri-fold wall or whatnot. And I want to put these, mount these some way so they're a little bit more Mm, stable sturdier stable stable and see so you just put them in there like that and you just add them like that so pretty pretty kind of cool uh dollar and a quarter i think that's an excellent price so adding these up you're still saving money from buying one of these i know there's more of these uh per you know units you'll have to get more units to make 48 but it's still a deal versus this one here. So 
very cool. And then also, if you're into other collectibles, uh, it shows the cars there, but if you're into collectible uh, figurines or something like that, you can turn it and, uh, you know, store them uh, vertically versus horizontally. So really kind of cool. I just wanted to, uh, you know, show you guys something cool that I found. It's kind of, I don't know, just a product review of uh, stuff that you can hold your Land Rovers in. <laughs> How's that? All right, well, that's it for today. I got to get going. We're going to get out of here. We're going to zoom in on all these fine, fabulous Land Rovers. All right, that's it. I got to get out of here. Thank you for joining me today. And remember, slow traffic, keep running. Have a great Rover day.